morning everybody myself Vipin Indwar and I'm the student of the Siliguri B.A. Tarai College today I have brought the part 2 of the previous chapter which we have done that is active and a passive voice so today we will deal with the same the last class which I have dealt with I will explain with the example each and every aspects which is given in the board for the uh, previous knowledge for the recap I can say that Again, I am telling you that you should have a good knowledge and tense, then only you will be able to solve this question. So let me revise the previous things which we have done in the part 1 of the active and a passive voice. So I have given you the chart that is the tense I have written, simple present, present continuous, present perfect, simple past, past continuous, past perfect, simple future, future perfect. These 8 things I have taken and along with that I have written the active part and then I have written the passive part as I have told you the previous class active part is known as the main verb and passive part is known as a helping verb so let's go on, go on to the quickly on the five steps which I have told you is that five steps of solving the active into the passive is that first you have to identify the subject that is subject verb and object and then swipe I have told you in the swipe what happens is that subject will go to the subject will go to the object position and object will come to the subject positions over here the next one I have written is that the convert V into V3 always you have to remember that the verb which ever form which it will be you have to convert that particular sentence into the third form of it the next I have written add helping verb before the main verb helping verb I have already told that helping verb at this main verb is this one active part so next coming towards the last one that is adding preposition by before the subject that means when the subject will go to the last during that time, before that one, you have to use the preposition that is by. So let's begin with the examples and see each and every category which I have written the eight parts. The sentence which I have not taken are not applicable for this kind of active and passive question. So I have not taken the rest like the, I have not written like present um, present continuous uh, present perfect continuous. I haven't taken like past uh, perfect continuous. I haven't taken that means. They are the such kind of sentence that will be not applicable for the active and a passive voice. So let's deal with this one. The first one, I will give the examples with the tense first one that is simple present. So let's see the example and understand the way I have to. So remember the concept that is the five steps so that it will be very much clear to you all. So make sure that you look at the board properly. Now, for the first one, I have written the simple present. I'm giving you the examples with a simple present. So I have written for the simple present, I have written that the first part should be identify. We need to identify the subject, verb, and object. Over here, looking at the sentence, that means I have given one example over here. Uh, example is he writes a letter. That means over here, my the verb is in which form? The main verb. Sorry, the main verbs. So main verb I have written in the first form that is write or writes. It can be in the first form only. Then only you have to recognize that that particular sentence belongs to a simple present. So for example I have written he writes a letter. Over here first thing I have to identify which one is the subject. That means he is my subject. And then we have to find the verb. Verb is writes. And all letter is our what? It is a object. Got it? The first step is clear. The next one I have written is that convert, eh, sorry, swipe. Swipe means subject will go to the object position and object will go to the subject position. Okay, here my subject is he and the object is a letter. So what I will do is that I will bring the object at the first and send the subject at the last. So ex exactly I will do in the same manner. A letter I will write. And then the subject will go to the last, that is the object position. I will write over here he as for I have written he I have told you in the previous class whenever you are turning the pronoun what you have to do is that you have to remember the word like I will be me he will be him she will be her they will be them and we will be us so remember this concept of the whenever you are changing the pronoun that means over here the sentence is he so what I have to take is that in he means I have to use the word whenever I'm turning in a passive voice I have to use the word him so let us see 
this one properly. Okay. So as per I have written a letter over here, he will go to the object position. That means what? He is what subject. So in place of he, I will write what? Him. And the next step is you have to convert into V3. V3 means as per my first letter, that is it, it is in the first form. So what it will be? Write, wrote, written, and the fourth form is coming as a writing. So write, wrote, written. So what I will write over here is that third form. Write, wrote, written. I will take written or letter written. And the next one is helping verb. Helping verb, you have to come to the passive side. Simple present, come this one. Take is, am, are, write. I cannot write a letter M written. I cannot write a letter R written. I cannot write a letter is written that means that is pronouncing the grammatically correct that's why i will take the word is over here so that it will be suitable as i will pronounce it will be go in the correct sentence so a letter so my helping verb what will you do is and the last is that preposition the last step i have written add the preposition by before the subject by you have to use the word by. That means what happened is that I have to use before the subject. Over here, subject has gone to the last. That means somewhere over here it will come as a by over here. Clear? So, ultimately, my answer will be what? A letter is written by him. Clear? So, let me write out the outcome of this answer. That is a letter is written by him. So this is the easiest concept through which you can express how the sentence you are turning into the passive form. Whenever it is an active, it will be turning into the passive form. So now let's look at the second example that is present continuous. So for example, I have written, Anisha is making a cake I have written. So I will remember that how it is belong, this sentence belongs to this present continuous. How I will know is that I have to see, I have to see the word over here, the main verb. The main verb is from the active and passive verb. The is is been used in the sentence that is is. So now turning that one exactly into the passive voice, how we have done in the previous knowledge, exactly in the same way I will do. So the first one I need to identify over here the sentence, that is which one is subject, which one is object and which one is the verb. So let's see, Anisha, Anisha means what? It will be my subject, making is my verb and a cake will be my object. So let's see the second step that is swipe, that is object will come first, that means I have to write a cake. And then the subject will go to the last, that is Anisha. Okay. And the third one is, you have to convert into V3. That means over here my verb is in fourth form, ing. That means what will be in its first form? The first form will be make. Make, made, made. That means second and third form will be not be changing over here. That means the second form of the verb and the third form will be remaining the same. And the fourth form is making. So make, made, made. So I will write made. And then the fourth one, I have to take the helping verb. That means helping verb before the main verb. Over here, helping verb, if I will see is that, this is my passive form is the helping verb. Over here the word is, sorry, in the present continuous, I have to say is, am, are plus being. That means being is a compulsory word. Along with this three, you have to add being over here. So exactly in that manner, which one will be suitable? A cake are being made by Anisha. I cannot write are or I cannot write a cake am being written. So exactly the grammatical correct manner will be the word is. A cake is, is I will write and plus being. That means is being and the last one is that is you have to add the preposition by before the subject. My subject is what Anisha. So before Anisha I have to write by. So exactly by concept we will come to a crystal clear over here. A cake 
is being made by whom? Anisha. So see the ultimate answer. A cake is being made made by Anisha. So this is the correct answer which we will get. So in very easy process we have completed the second one also. Let's see the third one now. So exactly in the same manner let's look the third one that is present perfect tense. So the main verb is have and the helping verb will be have been. So for example I have written I have. Have means what it belongs to present perfect tense. Then what I have written is that example I have eaten a burger I have written. So what I will do is that same you have to remember the concept like subject will come to the object position object will go to the subject position you have to remember the verb three and then the next one is that you have to add a preposition that is by before the subject. So remember the concept so exactly I have not written the whole concept so now we will directly solve the questions like for example I have written I have eaten a burger so a burger will come to the first and then I will become what a him I will become me so exactly in the previous also I have told you that like I will become me he will become him she will be her and they will become them we will be us so exactly you have to remember whenever you are changing the pronoun into the passive form you remember the concept so exactly a burger have been that means been is there so coming towards a perfect have is there have been you have to take compulsory have is there blindly take the have been so that your sentence will be correct so what I have done is that a burger have been eaten by me clear the next one is talking about the simple past now simple past over here you have to see the mean that is a main verb active form a road is there that means a right a road it is in the which form it is in the second form so exactly you have to turn that particular sentence into the third form so example I have written for the simple past he bought a car he will be subject bought will be verb a car will be the object. So exactly in the same manner what I have written is that I have brought the a car at the beginning and then you have to look at the word that is a helping verb which one will be suitable. That means this one talking about simple past was or where I have to take I have taken a was over here. So was bought this by that means bought is the second form. Even the third form will be bought only because the first form is by. Buy, bought, bought and buying is there. So exactly I have written bought and then I have used the preposition that is buy before the subject. He has become what? I have converted into him. Clear? So now the coming towards the next one that is the fifth one. Past continuous. Talking about the past continuous, past perfect, simple past or simple future or the future perfect. These are the questions which I have written. Clear? So for example, I have written over here, Sarah was singing a song and then past Ram had finished home, ha, homework and then simple future, she will accept the offer. These are the question I have written, I have not given the question, answer over here. You need to solve what you have received from my logic, which has made the concept easy or not. So deal with these questions, which I have written over here, in this manner, we have came to the end of this chapter. Thank you everybody.